So, unboxing time. This is Prowl 1701, and it's time for another Ultra Savers unboxing. I would had some rewards points and a $20 coupon. So, all told, it really only cost me about $20. Bucks. It's just a $75 box, so it'll probably be a stunt saver, probably not sound. Um, but I felt in the mood to do an unboxing and another review, so I went ahead and ordered it. I mean, it's only $20 bucks shipping included with all the coupons and rewards points. Uh, the box is very light. I was kind of hoping for maybe a premium hilt or get one of those really special ones with sound, but the box is incredibly light. So I'm figuring it's probably just one of your basic sabers, your Eon, your Dominics, your Sentinel, something like that. Anyway, I won't bore y'all with the details about everything. We'll go ahead and get into it. Oh, really well packaged. Okay, the blade is just separate. I keep forgetting it comes wrapped in a claw. Right. Got a mid-grade blade. I do like the fact that the mystery boxes let you uh, pick whether you get a ultra edge or a mid-grade blade. I would always prefer a mid-grade, or most of the time I prefer a mid-grade. I got a 32 inch blade. They do let you pick your blade size at no extra cost, and that's that's always nice. I think my blade stopper got stuck in there. Yeah, there it is. I'll get it later. Because of a little blade cap stuff. Get it later. Let's see what we got here. It doesn't feel like much weight, so again, I think it's probably just a basic saver. That's a lot of bubble wrap. Let's see. That looks like a dark sentinel, maybe? Cover tech wheel. Oh, they write their handwriting is like my handwriting, which might be the meanest thing I've ever said to anybody. It's a dark sentinel. It is a dark sentinel with a red light with a red button. So it's probably going to be a red LED, but we'll see. I've had two dark sentinels. Uh, I ended up getting rid of both of them, but it's not a bad hilt by any means. So we have a dark sentinel. With a cover tech wheel placed on the back. Personally, I prefer the Dark Sentinel without a cover tech. Uh, just that just gets in the way. That's got to come off. Um, but it's a nice little bonus since normally that's something that would cost you money. I personally don't like it because it gets right in the way of where I grip. Just like on my Saber Forge ones, they tend to put theirs right here, and uh, I always have to remove them, so that'll have to come off. But it looks nice, and. I bet it's a red LED, but let's find out. Oh, nope, I was wrong. It's an orange LED. That looks like fire orange, which actually goes good with the black hilt. Gives it a bit of a Halloween look. So, uh, again, I've had other Sentinels. Um, it's a nice hilt. I like it. Uh, I ended up selling mine, but, but it's still a decent hilt. It's comfortable. It looks nice. A little basic, but it's all right. Uh, a little cover tech as a bonus, which really... I would have preferred to not, but that's cool. I mean, that's that's the thing about a mystery box. You never know what you're going to get. I do like the fact it's got the little red sticker there. I always prefer when they have a blue or a red one. And it's fire orange, and I like fire orange. It's a cool color. It's got a nice Halloween look. So, that's what we've got in our $75 mystery box. we got a Dark Sentinel Stunt Saber, just to check, so we'll be certain. Standard setup with a bonus cover tape wheel in fire orange and uh, probably get a review up for it sometime soon after I have time to play around with it a little more anyway this is Prowl 1701 this has been a $75 mystery box unboxing and thank you for watching